Hey guys, what is up? I am Double Driven. Today's list, um, some White Frost. I tried to go with something that mimics the um, Wanged type build. I got um, Portal with the greedy uh, NL Conquer and Sage. Um, just to be able to get that tempo because you want round control with Frost. If they bleed you, you might not have enough points. We do have Yeghern and Osril as a nice finisher. Aronin can be huge in the game. Uh, they will want to remove it because three a turn is pretty rough. Um, we got Avalok in here as well. Um, it's a sunset list, so um, you know, in, in round two, even if you have like you'll see in this game, um, you could play Yeghern. Uh, the Wanderer comes out, and they got like you know. 22 points they got to make up uh it can get kind of rough for them so uh that's just a nice like tempo pass i got megascopes in here to possibly either get uh, a crew or a conqueror you're trying to get the conquerors but um you know i guess that you can get a foglet as well you know whenever you put a row effect it uh it gains some stuff so it's not really optimal but the four when you're doing 4p i noticed man monsters like doesn't have any um for provision like removal other than like natural selection it's kind of rough um oh i'm on artifacts that's why um but yeah their their stuff sucks undying thirst i mean like yeah feast of blood <laughs> and uh, I do have one spores in here too, um, just for something that gets boosted. You know, maybe you can get, keep that dominance. Um, they do have two hideous feasts in here as well. I mean, I, that's the best I can do. <laughs> we need the uh, monsters need some better uh, 4P damage cards for sure. Um, but uh, short video today, guys. I actually think I go up against my um, Enslave Five Ball deck, uh, which was kind of cool. So, um, people are actually upvoting the list, hopefully. Thank you for that. But, um, quick game today, guys. Thank you for everything. I'll see you at the end. Alright, enslaved friend, okay. I guess, what's a good target for him to steal? Um... Well, we can do better, can't we? Avalok is huge. Drop this. Alright. I guess we drop the selection. Okay, so we're going to be copying a bunch of sevens, which should be okay. So we go front row. We go portal. We try to play around the assassinations and stuff I guess we have an answer for his helge blightmaker it's fine so we get this down flip he's got a lot of tempo too um we might start Megascope in next. That's fine. Yeah, I think we start Megascoping. Um, what's the best way to do this? Because they spawn to the right. No matter what, one's going to be on an island. So we get one. We get another one here in a second. And we can play another one. Double Blightmaker is just so rough, man. No good wine will come from you, not even okay. So we go again. Uh, yeah, we keep we keep going like this. So I would imagine he has like assassinations and stuff. So we get another one. That's thirty-one. 
I could probably go crew next. But he's playing on melee, so it's... Yeah, that's not that great. I think I could play one more card. So we get a 7. We lose 1. We gain 1. 33. 15. No foggle, it's kind of hurt. We want to. We have to have a long round, though. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. So we got a reset, a heat wave for a possible. I guess we don't really know what he is yet. That's good for the the bleed. Okay, those are huge. We just go here. And then pass. He wants a long round too, but I think we want it more than him. Cantarella, there's some bad cards in there, sir. Does he get my... <laughs> Alright, let's pass. We don't wanna We don't wanna mess around here. So he's uh Joaquin with all the low provision stuff. I, I it, it might even be the deck I put out there. It's got Roderick. I mean that's he needs 16 points. He doesn't get there with that. So he went... Oh, okay. So he's using his leader on that. So That's huge. Him pulling that uh, spores. That's, that's massive, man. I mean, him not being able to steal like a foglet or something. Alright, what's left? Um, Aridin. There's better cards. Okay. That's fine. We can go uninteractive for a turn. Yeah, this is. I think this is my deck. If he plays a. Uh, so we can move it next turn kill it. Yeah, I really think it's ball and stuff. Oh, he's gonna save it. That's fine. Um... Heat wave it. Well, resetting it makes it bad here. I think we move this one. Oh, it makes it awkward. Don't it? I guess we move this one. Uh, do we care more about the ball or this thing? I think being on interactive is huge. We get this. This gets better cards. I'm missing out on the Aridin kind of hurts, but yep, this is my deck. Uh, that hurts that he gets this. Um, so we. How do we want to do this? We want to move first. So we go here. I guess we just let it chill. Ah, that's... Oh, it kills it. Well, it doesn't get any value then. But, that's fine. Mm. 
yeah, this this eating the poison kind of hurts. We're gonna get value on our reset. Osro Lasse. Oh, that's he gets that. That's still gonna. Well, how many points does it get? Twenty one. Six. Yeah, this is gonna get eight up. I think we just go. Avalok front row. Well, I think we go Avalok back row. We don't want to move that, right? We just go Avalok front row. So that dies. Next unit we can move. Gotta be a little bit bigger, right? I think we play our foglets. So that's just a bleed play. Yeah, I guess the reset value is. He's gonna. Joaquin, though, right? I mean, that's gonna happen. Um. I think we go Foglet. Yeah, because he's going to lose this. We're still going to get our Oz roll. We're going to get a reset on his Joaquin. He does kill the 11, which hurts. Yeah, I think this is the deck I play. So he still has Usurper left. I do think we get the fog lit down. Yeah, he's gonna coo. I guess he can still get Usurper. This dies next turn, which is huge. So he kills a 21. Yeah, he gets Usurper. So he kills a 21, gains a 14. And I could just, is that our, that's gonna be our reset, right? So he loses 21. Um, yeah, I think we get our thing down before it loses its value. Um, I think we go... Here. And we just drop this. Still have two more turns. Boom, boom, back to back. Movement. So 36. This is a seven point reset. It's gonna have a couple more though, right? He still has location. He could snatch an Aridant. Well, he gets a free Aridant. Why didn't we stack there? Um. Actually, we're going to lose one on it, huh? Um, so what's his last couple cards? He has... Yeah, the location, which he hits a 10, so he gets 11. But that's our reset. So that's good. That didn't play for really anything. Monsters, no, a for now. Uh, yeah, this one, the ordering got a little wonky here. So we get a 13. And then a reset on an 11. Is it enough? I think so. So what's he want to put back? Portal? Yeah, that's fine. All right, so we lose a couple points. Damn it. This gets reset, 41. We lose one. He needs a 
14. Oh, wow, we had real good... Well, I guess he was a 9. We, I think we got him, though. Um, Oswald goes front row. Yeehern. <laughs> awesome, dude. Playing, playing the list I made. Hopefully you uploaded it. <laughs> Hopefully you uploaded it. Cool. I like it. Hey, that's the video for today, guys. Um... Like always, just thank you so much for everything, man. I greatly appreciate all of you. Sorry for the short video today. Um, try and get a, a bigger one out tomorrow. But um, you guys are wonderful. I'll see you guys next time.